Welcome to the Newport Aquatic Center on the beautiful Newport Back Bay. The NAC is home to the Makapo Aquatics Project and the NAC Makapo Outrigger Paddling Team, a collaboration between the Newport Aquatic Center and Makapo Aquatics. This unique and amazing team is made up of blind and visually impaired paddlers and their sighted coaches. They meet three days a week to practice two hours to prepare for highly competitive Southern California Outrigger Racing Association races. Let's talk with some of the NAC Makapo team members. Meet Roger Bouchon, team paddlers Efren Becerra and Chris Gavin, and coach Tony Bouchon. Join us on August 11, 2018 for our Benefit Luau. We're partnering with the Newport Beach Hawaiian Lions Club and the NAC to hold a special event that will raise money to ensure we achieve our mission of helping blind and visually impaired people live active lives. Tickets are $60 per person with a special VIP experience also available. For more information or to purchase tickets, please visit www.makapo.org slash Benefit Luau. We are at the very beginning of the season. We have several more races that we'll be doing um, next week, Saturday, not this coming Saturday, but the following is a race in Marina Del Rey that we're contemplating doing. That will take us a little bit out in the ocean, which is something that is um, not usual for us. So we're really gonna have to, to think about that one. And then there's a couple other races that we'll be getting involved in as well. And then the last race again is down in San Diego, which is another fun one for us. So we've got a lot of training to do to get ready for the racing, but that's what we're here to do. Uh, yeah, we had a race uh, about two, three weeks ago down in San Diego. It was um, first race of the year. That stuff um, it was fun. Went pretty well. We had a really good start and all stuff. Uh, still have a little stuff here and there we need to work on, but it looks pretty promising. I, I was excited. I was excited. I kind of wanted to get it over with just so I could have it under my belt and just have that experience of racing. It was like just my heart was just pumping in and <laughs> I, that, that was, it was a workout. I lost track of time as we were paddling. I was like, when's this thing going to be over? Because <laughs> we had never practiced that hard for that long yeah. before. So it was kind of like an endurance, you know, test. Um, but it was good. I mean, it was all positive. Um, I think we all led up to it, like having good practices, um, the startups and just the long sets that we were doing. So the practice and the, the coaching by Tony was awesome. And uh, just, it was, it was really exciting. It was really exciting. For me, it was very exciting uh, being involved with the team for many years. Many times, we uh, it's been more of a uh, to finish the race to, and feel like you did your best. And many times, the results was clearly in the back of the pack. But uh, as Efren had pointed out, we had a good start, and that start not only put us up in the top five or six, we stayed there for most of the race. We understand now uh, enough about our techniques and and what we're doing in the canoe that we can we can close that gap. We can uh, beat some of those crews. Uh, from from being on the podium to where we were at was less than 60 seconds. Uh, well, the other thing that's really nice is that these guys have a lot of really good positive energy and a, and a good drive behind them. So there's no him and hawing and I don't want to go. It's like, when do we get to go? So it's really, it's a nice refreshing twist on the, uh, on the workout schedule. We welcome new members and want to expand our Ohana the Makapo family. So whether you want to paddle, volunteer, or give, come join the Makapo Aquatics Project. Come out and play!